I am scared. I never meant this to happen. Sean might never want to see me again. Yesterday, at the inquest into the shooting of James McIver last September by the security forces, the soldier who fired the shot in a written statement read out in court stated he shouted two warnings, then saw McIver. Shayna, love. Mary? Rhoda? What about Sean? I don't know. Oh, I mean, it's fine. It's just fine. Don't you usually go on the weddings, Dees? Majella Miller was telling me you weren't there. That's right, I had to go to the doctor. I tell him I was asking for him. Sure, I remember when he was a wee lad running around here. God love them all. Jesus, three weeks married and he's arrested. Mommy, for Christ's sake. I'm sorry. This isn't the time. He might get 20 years. What will we do? I told you there would be trouble, but you wouldn't listen. I have to catch the three o'clock train. Your father doesn't know I'm seeing you. You better not call me. Here, take this. Is he near Patrick or Joe? Is he sleeping any better? Last week he said he wasn't sleeping very well for worrying about you. I told him to take care of himself, never mind about us. I know, I told him the same. Look, he won't tell me. Is he going on the blanket? 
course he is. You knew he'd want to. Stan. Have a good visit. Thanks. God love the wee fella, he's got to hang Aye. over. You weren't so quiet last night down the club. Just stop shouting, love, will you? My head is busting. Mm. What's up, Hugh? Can't hear you from the back. <laughs> 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 Troopers land at the bottom of Belfast Lock. Start. <laughs> Are you still worried about Tuesday? Look, I'll change my visit to Sean and I'll come up with you on Tuesday. Okay, guys. Well, what about Darman? Yeah, he got five years. Desperate. Are you still seeing your man? I'm sure him, Sean. is a stingy bastard. Not his brother, neither. Quite your dead. Darn. Look at the state of your man. What about them three down there? <laughs> Jackie, where's she looking? Are you right, Swish? Come on, you down and see what they're doing later on. Here, I'll take her, mate. Come on, uh, fuck's sake, Jackie, get your arse in the gear, go for it. Bukhar! A prisoner's wife. Jesus Christ. You fell for that. Well, how are you doing anyway? Tell us all the news. Your Maria had a baby girl last Tuesday. Jesus. Eight great. pounds. Eight pounds, right? Your mommy, she's out of hospital. How is she? Great. Great. What else? How's your work? All right. I might go to Donegal in the summer. Donegal? For what? Well, they say if I can improve my Irish, they'll take me on full time. Who would you go with? Not that Debbie one. I've heard she's a real slag, that one. She's just young, Sean. She's into having a good time. That's still allowed, isn't it? Paula was saying, I didn't think you and her would have a thing in common. You being married, though? No? 
<laughs> anyway, I can help you with your Irish. Give you a few wee lessons. We've got our open university exams in it next week. Right, Malloy. Time's up. Better say Sloan there. You sure everything is all right? I can ask people to help you out. No, it's all right. With the job and everything. But, Sean, I'm just so... I can't know. Listen, love. We'll talk next week, right? I promise. I want to go before the screws start hustling. Till next week, then. isn't it? I was in our waiting last week. What's your name? Sheila Malloy. Oh, are you Sean's wife? He's in the same block as my son, Leonard Hughes. Has he talked to you about him? Yeah, I'm just about his singing. Oh, I. That's a specialised form of prison torture. <laughs> How long is he doing? 20 years. I've been coming seven. God, it's a long time. Have you any wings? No, we didn't have time. How are you doing, Mary? Hi, Bessie. Well, how are you doing? Did you have a Teresa Lynch? It's a dreadful thing to happen to such a nice young girl. She had beautiful hair, too. They said it was for shoplifting. But I heard it was for playing around. How are you? How about you? All right. What are you doing now? I'm heading to that hot spot in Ballymurphy to watch telly. Then I won't be able to interest you in a quick point. No, I can't really. Why? You're not the one in prison. What would you know about it? Not much, I suppose. But you should go out more. Look, if you want to go out and do something, you could call me. As a friend, maybe. Okay, we'll go for a pint now. Is Maguire's okay? No, we need to go into town. Okay, sure. All visitors for visit room B, or the boss at the door. <laughs> Sean's wee brother, Michael, was killed. When was that? Let's 
Lucy. I married Sean just after that. Around the end of 79. God, you must have been very young. Yeah, we didn't have much going for us then. But as long as we were together, we were okay. Sean was a great dreamer then. Always making plans. Mad plans. It's funny. What? It's something I've been thinking about. I've never told anybody. Go on, you can tell me. Well, with the war, you can get to feel sexy around death. Not because it turns you on. Because you fear death. And the only way to feel alive is to be with someone. To make love. Does that sound strange to you? No. If you're serious about keeping it, maybe I could get a transfer back down to Dublin. We could get a house. Nobody bothers there. Listen, I'm not leaving my home or Sean. What's Sean got to do with this? This whole thing was never about you or him. It was about me. Everything has always been decided for me. Now I'm going to have my own life. My own life with this baby. What are you planning to do? Stay here? Come on, Sheila. People won't like it. If this is a problem for people, they're going to have to deal with it. The same with Sean. I stood by him through it all. The blanket, the dirt, and the deaths. Now I'll see if he's got the strength to stand by me. Who do you think you're kidding? I can't just walk away. I have to talk to him. And if he accepts this, then we'll try and work something out. But if it was to go on between me and Sean, it had to change anyway. You and Sean. What about me? Are you sure? We could have... I am sure. I want you to go even if things don't work out. Wilson. <laughs> 